What's up, everybody? Tyler Horvath here with another episode of The Daily Tea. Today, I'm going to be talking to you about growing your Instagram following. So if you are a business or a service and you aren't using Instagram, you are missing out. It's one of the biggest social media platforms there are, and it is a great way to get free traffic to your website or business. So in this video, I'm going to show you six simple tips that you can do to 10x your Instagram following. The first thing that you need to do is create good content. So you aren't gonna get any followers unless you're creating good content. Do you wanna follow someone that never posts anything or whatever they do post something, you know, it's a blurry picture, it doesn't look very good. Uh, you're not gonna follow people like that. People that post good content are a lot more likely to grow their following and get more followers. So posting good content at least once a day. But you should try and aim for about two a day. Any more than that and uh, your followers are gonna see you too much and they're gonna unfollow you and any less, you're not gonna grow followers and you might not retain your current followers if you're not posting good stuff and posting on a regular basis. So the next thing that you need to do is use hashtags. So hashtags are kind of how Instagram bases their searches and their keywords off of. So each post kind of has tags that are hashtags and you add these tags to your post and if people want to search by hashtag to find you know relevant users or uh, relevant content, they can do that. So using a lot of hashtags in your Instagram post will help you get seen by more people because the more hashtags you use, the more chances of that you know hashtag being searched in Instagram. So another good thing to do is to go and look up hashtag generators online and find highly used hashtags that are relevant to your post and add those into your post. So this way, you know, more people are searching for these certain hashtags, they're more likely to find you and like you and follow your stuff. So make sure that you're using at least 15 relevant hashtags per post. So try and stay with 15 hashtags or more per post and a lot more people will see your profile and they will see your post. So make sure that you're posting daily and you're posting good content and you put hashtags on that content. So the next thing that you do is pretty simple. It's just add friends. So go to Instagram and you know, search by hashtags that have to do with your company or your business. So let's say you are an entrepreneur and you want to, you know, be friends with other entrepreneurs and start following other entrepreneurs to get them to follow you. Then you would search for the hashtag, you know, entrepreneur or entrepreneurship and simply follow all the people that have used that hashtag or are interested in that hashtag. So what this does is when you follow them, they're likely to follow you back because, you know, that's just kind of how social networks work. You follow someone, they follow you. And so you're just gonna do this on a mass scale. So um, every day, try and follow as many people as you can. I know there's limits on Instagram. I believe that it's you know a thousand uh, follows a day or something like that. So when you're first starting out, you wanna make sure that you, you know, don't get too close to that threshold or you could get your Instagram account banned. And let me tell you from experience, if you've you know, spent months and months growing your following just to get banned, it's a terrible thing. So make sure you, you know, stay within those guidelines and try not to add um, over a thousand people a day or unfollow a uh, thousand people a day. So make sure you stick to those guidelines, but um, adding friends is the fastest and easiest way to get the most amount of followers. So just go and follow people in your industry, in your niche, and they will likely follow you back and then, you know, see your content and in turn visiting your, your website or your business. So the next thing that you can do is simply engage with the social media platform. So engage with your followers, engage with uh, people who are not following. So let's say you search out your hashtag for entrepreneurship and you see some posts that you like. Simply comment on those posts, you know, thanks for sharing, follow me, running polls, contests, 
um, you know, asking your followers what they think about something, tell them to post something. Creating an engaging Instagram profile will get you a lot more followers and a lot more likes and comments on all of your posts, which in turn makes great content. So make sure that you're engaging with your followers and engaging with your non-followers that will hopefully become your followers because they like you know that you're engaging and they see that you're engaging so they will probably be more likely to follow you. So now the fifth thing kind of takes all of these into account. So once you are getting a little bit bigger, you start to realize that you just simply don't have time to you know, add a thousand friends every day and post content with all the hashtags you need in it every day and engaging with everyone. It's a lot of work. So it's smart to use automation tools. There's plenty of tools online that can help you automate all of these things and save you a lot of time when you are growing your Instagram following. So there's a bunch of different types of tools. One is called FitSuite. And this is a social media posting platform that allows you to you know, schedule posts. Um, so you can create a ton of good content for your Instagram profile and you can schedule it to post you know, once or twice a day and you know, enter in all your hashtags and all that stuff and it will automatically post this stuff so you don't need to worry about creating the content and posting it every day. You can you know, take an hour, create a bunch of good content, a bunch of good images, and then you can you know, set up auto posts and scheduling and it will do all that for you so you don't even need to worry about that. Now on the other side, as far as the, the adding followers and engaging, you can use tools like Combin now this tool allows you to uh, automatically follow people you know, that, are, that are liked or interested in or have used certain hashtags. And you can also follow certain profiles or followers of certain profiles. So what I like to do is find someone in your industry that you know, has a lot of followers or you know, posts similar con content and does similar work than what you're looking to do and simply go and follow all of their users. So it's likely that those users will follow you because they're following someone who is you know, similar to you and is in uh, the same niche or industry that you are in. So once you have these tools set up, you're pretty much on autopilot. You have Hootsuite posting all your content and you have Combin um, engaging with your followers and adding friends and removing friends. Um, so simply add friends you know, to similar hashtags using Combin and then once they follow you, you can set it to unfollow them. So it's simply following and unfollowing and just growing your, your social media, growing your Instagram followers daily. Um, so it takes a little work to set Combin up and you know search the certain hashtags and get everything set up. But once you do that, it's all automated. I believe we pay about 10 bucks a month just for the single profile, but I think it's 15 or 20 if you wanna have you know up to five Instagram profiles and you can automate all of this process for you. So now the last thing that you can do to grow your Instagram followers is cross promotion so you should be on all of the other social media platforms like Facebook Twitter um, you know all of those YouTube now you can use these to grow your Instagram follower by cross promotion so if you have you know a thousand Facebook friends or 5,000 Twitter followers or 10,000 Twitter followers or you know a ton of YouTube subscribers share your Instagram with all of those channels and say, hey, if you don't follow me on Instagram, I'm always posting you know, great content, uh, and it's, you know, sometimes it's content that I don't actually post on Facebook or Twitter or whatever. And that will get them to follow your Instagram profile as well. So if you can leverage your other social media networks like Twitter and YouTube and Facebook, you can get some of your followers on those channels to come and follow you on Instagram. And it's the same for Instagram, you can also get more followers on you know, your Facebook or your Twitter by cross-promoting on your Instagram page. So I hope these six tips helped you figure out how to 10X your Instagram followers. Please comment below if you have any questions at all, and be sure to subscribe to my channel. I'm always posting great content on how to start and grow businesses online. So thanks, and have a great day.